Yeah, how's everyone doing? Uh, I've just got great news. We, uh, the Atari CEO, Fred Shatton, has just confirmed that the, the Atari VCS will be launching July 2019. Awesome. You know, uh, we have won PR since May 2018. Uh, and when I got my indie go go receipt, it said July 2019. So awesome stuff. And um, he said that um, Atari are no longer in debt, and that um, the the company has made loads of money, primarily through uh, roller coaster toy killing, uh, the Atari VCS and the the Atari Casino division. Now uh, he also said um, Atari are going to focus on Atari style games for the Atari VCS. They're going to do what they do best, uh, simulation games. Um, um and um strategy games they're not going to delve into that and like call of duty or battlefield because one they don't know how to do it until it's just out of depth and uh, they are going to focus on what makes atari great for atari fans and i'm really excited about that you know um so uh, but there's so many games that atari could uh, do updates for like Night Driver, um, um, other games, Sky Driver, so, so many games, but um, I'm really happy right now, um, but there's still a long way to go, um, a long time to wait until it comes out, but um, when the CEO confirms it, that's pretty much it, you know, it will come out, uh, now I hope it's a, it's a success, I hope it puts a tie back at the top of the game where they belong, uh, in my opinion, uh, but uh, I think they have just too much competition. But hearing them say these things, we I'm glad this guy's in charge because, in my opinion, he's doing the right things. If we was in charge of Atari, we'd be doing the exact same thing that your man Fred Chesnus is doing. Uh, we'd be focusing on what makes Atari great and Atari games. You know, um, it's not Call of Duty or Battlefield. It's Atari games. You know, and he's right about that. So now he says, okay, they've made over twelve million over the last year, and uh, they don't have just loads. Of, they don't have the resources or money to do a big game like Call of Duty or a big racing game. Uh, so that's why they're gonna stick to what they can do and what they want to do, and that's Atari focused games like um, Tempest Four Thousand, Roller Coaster Toy Killing. They're not gonna do anything else out of that realm. Uh, they're not going to do Call of Duty, they're not going to do Battlefield. They would have could, but it would be too much of a risk for them to do it, you know what I mean? And it probably wouldn't work as well anyway. So, but I'm glad that uh, he's, had to, he's had to clear that issue up, you know what I mean? So, like, okay, that may disappoint other, a lot of people out there that won't, won't have the same games that an Xbox One have or PS4. He pretty much uh, said that it'll be Atari games, Atari focus games only. And that makes me really happy because it this is an Atari console for Atari fans. We've been waiting for this for over 20 years. Uh, we've been we've been through the ups and downs of Atari throughout 40 years. And Atari are back. And uh, we hope that um, they take top spot on gaming. Will they? Probably not. But uh, we always believed in the Atari VCS. I always believed in Atari. Uh, like, um, for me personally, um, when I was a kid, a teenager, an old grown man, uh, I've always enjoyed their games and they've, they've always given me hours and hours of entertainment. And my nephews, when they come over, they can enjoy it just as well. So uh, it's a generational thing, Atari. You know, um, I'm sure that there's uh, fathers and grandfathers out there that passed it down. You know, uh, so yeah, I'm really happy about that. Um, so yeah, um, I'm really happy that the CEO of Atari just confirmed this. So there's a long way to go, but we we'll say by Christmas time, um, it'll be out, it'll be available for everybody. But in July 2019, the Indiegogo backers will will get a force before anybody else. So I'm really happy about that, and the uh, the um, uh, so yeah, so um, I just wanna say, make a quick video about that. Now, um, people are gonna say that I'm making this up, and 
I don't have any concrete evidence, but if you, t- if you type in Atari VCS in Google and go to news, you'll see the Atari CEO interview there, and he explains it all in detail. But, but it's not just the Atari VCS that, that has brought Atari back. It was uh, um, roller coaster to Kion, Atari Casino, and other um, things, you know. So I'm really happy. So thanks very much for watching, and see you all later. Take care. Bye-bye.